So another activity that is part of the suggested activities for today had to do with making art out of the rocks. So these were the rocks that we collected last week. While I didn't wash them, I did rinse off a few of them. But what we can do is if you still have rocks around, we can stack them. Wonder how we can stack them. What if I start with, oh, let's see. Here's a real smooth round rock. Let me put that on the bottom and see what happens. All right, let's put a big, huge rock on top of it. See if that works. Oh, it didn't stay, did it? It fell. Wonder if I need to try something different on the bottom. What if I started with the big rock on the bottom? Maybe I could do that. I could start with the big rock, then maybe put another rock on top of it. Maybe another rock on top of, oh, it fell, but I could try it again. So the idea is to try to balance them. You gotta have patience. And if they fall, it's okay. You just keep trying. Here we go, I'm gonna try to put another one on. Oh no, it fell. All right, let's keep going, let's see. Maybe I could try this one on the bottom. This is a pretty flat one. Maybe put this one on top. Maybe this one, look how flat that is. Put that one on top. Do you think I could do another one? What about this one on top? I have one, two, three, four. All right, let me see if I can do one more. Let's see if I can put five on. All right, let's see if it'll stay. Oh, I did it. I put five on top. Let's see. I'm gonna try one more. You ready? Do you think it's gonna stay? I have this one. Let's see what it does. I try to put it on the very top. fell. That's okay. So you guys can practice that if you have some of the rocks that you had from our exploration on Friday where we picked up some rocks and maybe you can stack them and see how tall you can make them and see if you can figure out maybe a bigger rock would go on top of a smaller rock. I don't know. Just got to figure out how they're going to balance. All right. Here's another fun activity. I'll see you later. Bye.